Here we are in London, one of the biggest cities in the world for one of the biggest events in the world. Yes, Seth, it's certainly going to be an exciting one. After years of preparation, London is finally ready to welcome the world to the 2012 Olympic Games. Such a magnificent city, so many views with the Thames stretching away into the distance. And with so many new venues waiting to be tested, this really could be the best games ever. The Olympic Stadium splendid, glowing like a beacon here in London's East End. And there the Olympic torch, the iconic symbol of the Games, shining over the city of London. What an absolutely beautiful sight. So many nations represented here, all ready to compete in true Olympic spirit. Yes, 80,000 people they're expecting in that stadium and it's going to be full to the brim, not a spare seat in the house. Just imagine the excitement down there in the crowd. Fireworks to show the start of these games and the first event is first thing tomorrow. Welcome to the Olympic Stadium then, where shadows are lengthening here. The long jump pit is where the action's at. We're in the qualifying rounds to see who will go through to the Olympic final. There's going to be plenty of competition here. These athletes equally matched. Not much between them at all. Well, I'm sure there are a few nerves down there. This is the first time this athlete's ever competed at the Olympic Games. Well, this is the first attempt in the men's long jump. Well, the rhythm was off, missed the board and didn't even follow through with the jump. Off he goes in round number two. Well, he looked distracted on his approach towards the board and really struggled to find the right speed. Well, the third attempt about to commence. Well, obviously, the nerves are at an absolute premium here. Fourth attempt. Oh, look at that. That's the celebration of a man with a new personal best. Well done. Here's the replay. Great Britain are in sixth place at the end of that round. Next, yeah, from Great Britain. So a nice rhythm on the runway here. What a moment for this athlete, a personal best and a great performance at the Olympic Games. A real reason to enjoy. Good news for Great Britain on the leaderboard, they're in first. Next up, the competitor representing Great Britain. Last chance saloon, sixth and final attempt. That attempt isn't going to count, oversteps the board and into the putting. And the confirmation of the fall.
design of the javelin has changed over the years, but the technique remains very similar. The key to this is all about the speed on the runway and then making sure at the point of release, the athlete's able to still stop before the line to keep the throw legal. Well, here we are in qualifying. Needs to put in a strong performance here. Well, here he is for round number one. Tight competition, this. Foul. Well, hasn't even managed to throw here. And this is the Olympic Games. All the preparation. And to fail like this is just embarrassing. Foul. Well, hasn't even managed to throw here. And this is the Olympic Games, all the preparation. And to fail like this is just embarrassing. Crowd really starting to enjoy this. It's a great spectacle at the London 2012 Olympics. Foul. Well, that's a foul, and I just wonder whether maybe he needs to take a bit off on the run-up. Sprinting so hard here, just couldn't slow down. I think he'll be quite happy with that throw. Great Britain, Great Britain in third place. Let's take a check on the rest of the positions. The fifth attempt. Well, that's another good throw. It's gone high. A new personal best, and this athlete is understandably delighted by that. To produce your best at the Olympic Games is all anyone can ask. <laughs> to produce your best ever performance at the Olympic Games, that's exactly what these athletes train for. And look at the delight on his face. Terrific atmosphere, and this really should bring the best out of these athletes. The next event is the final of the men's long jump. Team USA have dominated this sport over the years, but these days there is new competition from Cuba, Panama, South Africa, and also Spain. What's he got? in store here. Well, just fell back rather. And that will cost him some precious centimeters. But that attempt's going to count for nothing, I'm afraid to say. It's a foul. Well, it's an ugly-looking scoreboard for Great Britain. They're in last position. Well, the problem with that jump was the trajectory into the stand. It wasn't good. We're halfway through this long jump competition. This is a fourth attempt, then, for this athlete. Needs a good jump here. Good approach, this. Arms in the air, happy with that. That's another very good jump. Here's the replay. Well, let's look at the scoreboard then after that last round, and Great Britain are in first place. speed on the runway. Can he follow it up with good technique? I think he likes that. Let's take a check on the replay. Six rounds then. And one of these athletes will be crowned the champion. 
but that's a good jump. Hits the board nicely, that's another strong effort from this athlete. And finishing in third position with a bronze, it's China. to bring a lump to my throat the ecstasy of victory rewarded with a medal as they did traditionally at the olympic games it really is what makes it so great another fantastic achievement let's see who's won the medals then this is the medal tally Four years of preparations since Beijing, and these athletes now must be ready. Any injuries, any doubts, must be shoved clear from their minds. Well, this athlete has achieved absolutely everything here. A new personal best, and quite rightly, they're delighted. Here we go again then. Well, that's very close to a new personal best. Third attempt now. I think he's quite happy with that performance. Another good round for Great Britain, who lead the way here on the scoreboard by a significant distance. That one lands over 70 metres, but just how long is it? Fifth attempt now. Well, that is very, very close to a personal best. Sixth and final round, then, for this athlete. Well, this one's over 70 metres. He's delighted with that. Oh, that's terrific. Let's have a look at the replay. A magnificent throw. The approach, brilliant. The release point, great. And then it just came down to the distance. Fantastic. The winner of the bronze medal, France. Well, what a day it's been. And quite rightly. Enjoying every moment, soaking in the atmosphere here. These are memories that will live long for these athletes. And to take home a medal from an Olympic Games is a dream, a dream moment. Let's round things up then with a quick glance at the medal table.